Well, it is opening day for the brand new Fahrenheit restaurant on Public Square. It's in a location that sat empty for 10 years after the iconic John Q Steakhouse closed. Chef Rocco Whalen couldn't wait to give a tour of the reimagined space to the man who ran John Q's for decades. We were there to capture the moment and to get a look at the modern transformation. I'm happy to see a restaurant here to continue this tradition for so long. I can't wait to see what Rocco's done with the space. How are you, Rocco? Good to see you. I wouldn't have this any other way. You are a forefather of this restaurant. I'm glad to take on the torch. I'm glad to take the torch, and I'm ready. Uh, it's a completely different show inside than what you'll remember, but uh, these walls talk. That bar is here. I resurrected it, and I love you. And I can't imagine what it was like for you in the first days of your decisions to take on the steakhouse. But I hope this is as much, uh, has as much meaning to me as it does to you, Rick. You're opening Friday? Friday, 4 p.m. You had that little corner seat right here that was yeah. that money money booth for yeah, how many years? Was that was where everybody wanted great, to sit and be seen. Great spot. The resurrection of the bar had to be done, and the deal didn't work for the developer, for the, for the state, for the tax incentive. So. And that led us to a nine month delay. First thing I did was try to remember everything that we had set up in this space, but uh, this is a very uh, open space and, and friendly, and uh, it'll be great to, uh, for all the business that will happen here, but then all the, you know, the anniversaries and, and special events and occasions that'll happen here. I'm home. I'm at the corner of Main on Main, I think, and I'm ready to go and give Sherwin a big bear hug for the next 20, <laughs> 20 years. That they'll let me. We walk through the dining room. The velvet, old Hollywood, reminiscent feel, New Cleveland, Las Vegas-inspired sizzle. Jen, envision when we get going for our legendary buffet brunch, uh, only on Sundays. This is hot. Oh, look at this. You'll have a carvery there. You'll have somebody slicing some sandwiches. You'll be able to pick up some oysters and some shrimp and some crabs. And then the chef's expo table or the kitchen stadium, as we call it. The whole space, we wanted to be modern. Yes. Sure, we're soon a billion-dollar modern love affair next door. And we felt, OK, so you'll see throughout the space, upstairs, downstairs, this table, the, the main bar, the Cambria space. 75% of everything is new. There's a small gangster height menu that's six or seven, the short ribs, the spring rolls. We, they're staying. But the rest, the ideation, the kitchen, the space, the ovens, the mushrooms, the carrots, the tilt kettle that Chef Brody and I can make, 150 pounds with our braised legendary short ribs with our teriyaki lo mein ready to rock and roll for tonight. That smells so good. That's what we can do now. This is beautiful, Rocco. Uh, we uh, resurrected it, Rick. We took it out first thing. We sent it to Dalton, Ohio, which is uh, just an amazing group of uh, handcrafted woodsmen, manipulators that had to surgically bring it back to life, repair it. This, this is 100% original, yeah. never been replaced, only refinished. Your bar top for the last 38 years is uh, John Key sat in our space. Yeah. This is now our small dining room and our bar room. It was the conversation that went over this bar, the people that were here every night. If that bar could talk, I can't tell you the flood of memories that just came back from this. Let's go to the rooftop. In the vein of the stairs that goes up, this is uh, porcelain from it, uh, Italy. And then this is the rose, uh, rose room, second floor, my mother's name. All right, Rick. The first of its kind, a rooftop to anoint public square. There's an unimpeded view of public square that'll never ever be built on as long as I'm here now. We're classic, we're new, we're everything, and we want everybody to start paying attention to us. This is delicious. Oh my goodness. That's delicious. That's very good, try that. This has got success written all over it. That is just so cool. Marrying old traditions right with some new memories. Beautiful story. Thanks, Jen.